Hi guys, welcome back to Rihanna's Kitchen Corner. Today I'm going to take you guys to Gunfrayu, the top of Europe in Switzerland. We experienced the Gunfrayu on a train journey. You can experience the view of the Eiger, Monk and uh, Gunfrayu as you travel by rail to Europe's highest train station and visit the ice palace. You can get there by cable car or by coke wheel train via uh, Grindelwald or uh, Lauterbrunnen Wengen. Since we stayed in Lauterbrunnen, we traveled from Lauterbrunnen. Once you reach Switzerland, based on your stay, uh, first get the Gunfrayu travel pass. And this travel pass uh, fits only if you're, plan, if you're planning to uh, travel extensively in the Gunfrayu region only. The pass includes travel by train, bus and the gondola to some of the top of attraction in Switzerland. And that pass includes uh, boat cruises uh, in, on Lake Crude Brains also. And if anything that doesn't cover, you can also get a discount with this uh, region pass. Here comes the Gunfrayu Glacier Express. The ride to the top was a really amazing experience. And uh, the, uh, the first stop is uh, they will stop you for five minutes in the viewpoint. And uh, from there, they will take you to the top. We reached the Europe's highest altitude railway station, um, which is uh, 3,454 meters above sea level. After the scenic train ride to the top, you can enjoy the stunning views of the Alps. The activities at the Gunfrayu, a lift takes you 170 meter further up to the observatory. Uh, you can enjoy 360 degree view from here, both from the terrace and from the comfort of a building with the panoramic windows. The Alish Glacier is the largest glacier in the Alps. It has a length of about 23 kilometers and you can see it's a beautiful stunning day. Oh my goodness, we were so lucky we could able to see it properly. We have seen so many videos and uh, they've tried many times to see this view. Wow, amazing. I'm swimming uh, the Lauterbrunnen Valley from here. You can see that, right? Lauterbrunnen Valley. We came all the way up from there. Wow. You can see people down there hiking, and hiking will be a good experience up here.
The Alpine Sensation is a moving walkway with images, lights and music connecting the hall below the Spinex Observatory to the Ice Palace. Next we are going to visit Ice Palace which is your ticket includes the entry to the Ice Palace and there are many sculptures there. You must visit this. The Ice Palace is an excellent attraction which you must experience when you are at Gunfrayer. And um, I love the Ice Palace and the sculptures were great. Love the visual effects as we walk through the tunnels. It's very cold in here. You must wear the comfort clothing and make sure to hold the rails. You know, some of the uh, places are a little slippery. Um, otherwise, it's very good. Make sure to check the weather forecast as there is no point in going up if the good fire is covered in clouds. Dress in multiple thinner layers so that you can adapt to the different temperature throughout the day. Note that it can be very windy at the top, even during the end of August, so the temperature was very good. Uh, it wasn't that cold. We spent like one whole week in Switzerland and uh, we loved every single moment of our journey. The final destination is the chocolate shop. Of course, that's my family's favorite. Uh, the moment they landed in um, uh, Switzerland, that's the main thing. They're looking for chocolate, chocolates everywhere, chocolates. 
so they love it of course they bought some it was yummy and really you know um this place is amazing and i would highly recommend this to anyone and thanks for watching everyone hope you like this video i'll see you soon back with another one bye take care